So till now we have seen the six queries which we have executed. Next we shall go with uh, building a dashboard. So we shall build a dashboard in Power BI. Go to Power BI, click on new sheet. So rename all your graphs onto some particular names. So graph sheets so that uh, it will be easy for you to organize them. So you can by default while doing only we can do it in a single uh, report view so that uh, again it is not required. So what we have to do is to create a dashboard go to new page click on first sheet click on the particular visualization select copy visualization go to the page one paste the visualization resize the visualization however it is required okay go to page two select copy visualization click on that particular graph go to page one paste it and resize then go to third graph copy the visualization go to page one paste the visualization and adjust it based on the size okay then go to q4 select the pie chart copy visualization page one paste the visualization sorry paste the visualization and resize the visualization as and how it is required. Okay, I'll just increase the size of the graph. Just increase the size of the graph. Next, I'll take Q5. Here you have to select individually the two different graphs and resize it resize resize the graph okay go to fifth query copy copy the visualization paste it onto your sheet okay Copy the visualization. Go to sixth query. Copy visualization. Paste the visualization and resize it to the particular chart size. Okay. So this is how a dashboard is designed. You can also see if you just click on south, all the graphs will be changed to this particular filter. If I click on Midwest, it will change. So if I just click on outside, it will come up. If you want to check with mobiles and tablet view, so if you just click here, you can see what is the sales. So this is how a particular dashboard works. So this is the end of the first experiment. Ninth one, so which is the sales data analysis.